Greetings everyone, Fang Dancer 98 back at it again with a new reaction. In this case, we're going to continue on Super Mario Bros. Z Episode 4, Here Come the Koopa Brothers. So, we remember last episode where Yoshi, well, he had his green tail handed to him by Super Mecha Mario, by Super Mecha Zonic. That was, um, hard to watch, but... At least they got to him in time and got him some medical attention. So let's see how things go in this episode when we're dealing with a team of Koopa Troopers, apparently. Hmm. Should be interesting to see. Especially with apparently more and more people finding more of these gems. I told Yoshi found that one completely by accident. So what is it happens if people are actually looking for them on purpose? So, this is where we'll begin the episode and let's see how well it goes. I was not aware that uh, I could do the fly. That's good news. Yoshi's been covering. Ouch. Yeah, I think knowing the full story might help out with them continuing to trust you and help you on this situation. Sounds pretty par for the course so far. <laughs> yeah, I doubt it was that easy in the games, but yeah. <laughs> So what you're saying is it was similar to, say, I guess when Cell had the adaptive abilities of the various Saiyan bloodlines in him to help him come back stronger when he was defeated. Oh, there's something along those lines. I would imagine if Raditz or Gnappa was allowed to return, they'd be able to come back like this. Reminds me a lot of, like, if Vegeta stayed evil theories out there. For every time Goku beat him back, he would return stronger trying to challenge him and prove that he was the best. But first, let's see how the rest of this goes. 
Okay, now I'm definitely getting cell uh, comparisons here. Merging with the other androids. In this case, I'm merging with the other cyborgs, but either way. Turbo Metal Sonic. Oh, Medica Sonic. works with uh, Dr. Droz's situation. Oof. Forceful terraforming. That's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, I came right on top of Bowser. <laughs> Destroying Metal Bowser's Metal Shell.
Radio. Here we go! Super Mario Brothers! That's definitely the doctor. Crazy guy. So I can't believe his name is Dr. Gad. It's like Gad Zoops. <laughs> I'm gonna sound like that. What? what? <laughs> They got this version of the Dragon Ball Radar now. That should definitely help out from trying to beat Metal Sonic to them. Hopefully. The sad part is I don't think he's wrong about that kind of uh Radical drug. Really? <laughs> Radical job, dudes. They're all wearing different bandana cuts. Oh my gosh. Um, uh, Alvin Earthworm made a Mario World version of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Trolls under the employee of Bowser. I won't lie, that's actually pretty interesting. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. Also, the, the music's really feeding into that feel. It's not their old arcade games, I think. <laughs> oh 
tutto te la vedo I was about to say, oh, yeah. sound like it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, he has a hard head, I guess. 
Minute Rede. Uh oh. Yep, they activated it. Oh, this is gonna suck. <laughs> Oh, an architect for this place. Jesus. What happened to yellow? Matters have gone from bad to worse as another Chaos Emerald is stolen from our heroes. This time are the Cooper Brothers along with the Emerald Radar. Can our heroes recover from this brutal beating and make a comeback? Or has their quest already come to an end? You don't want to miss the next exciting episode of Super Mario Brothers Z. Dang, that was a... Uh... That was an intense one. I mean, all the parallels, all the nice music, all the fight scenes, and the backstory was, uh... That was, uh, that was dark. To find out the entire group that we've come to know and love from most of them. Sonic games are... Well, now they're dead, apparently. So, if they've all died, does that mean Big the Cat, Rouge the Bat have also joined those two guys? I know Big the Cat usually isn't a fighter, and oh man, that probably means Omega, thir Omega 13 was destroyed. That means Team Shadow Squad's down. Hmm. I mean, does that mean Chaotix, the Chaotix group? Jeez. That's a lot of main characters and friendly characters to suddenly lose all at once. Just one backstory. Sheesh. Anyway, I'll be seeing how things go in the next episode, guys. Hopefully you guys follow along too and see how things go from here. This will be and some more. Also, sorry, forgot to mention. If you do enjoy the, my videos and enjoy the reactions I'm giving out, along with the backstory of certain things and comparisons, let me know down in the comments below. You know, subscribe, check it out, and also I'm gonna have this video by itself in the description in case you guys want to check it out because this is an amazing work by Calvin Haynes, also known as Alvin Earthworm. So let me know what you guys think, and I will be back at it again in the next video. This has been. Solar Fang Dancer 98, signing off.